Well, now that all this is said and done, do you believe in demons? No, 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 no. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Well, sounds like the jury is still out. Anyway, I'll be coming out of this coffin again next time to demonize you with the chilling story of... Somebody tries to wind up a program and ends up being interrupted every single week. I think we better see who's behind this. You know, if you were to change one letter in the title of this, it could be about a guy who bought a really bad used car. It would be Curse of the Lemon. See, because a bad car is known as a... So, Mr. Gooley, do you think belief in demons is an antiquated idea? Well, but I have proof that demons still exist, oh. even in this modern technological age. Let me explain. I was hard at work on my computer one night when, at the stroke of midnight, the computer began to vibrate and shake, and suddenly, on the screen, a demon appeared. Sounds like every Zoom meeting I've ever had. <laughs> Quiet. The demon appeared on my screen and in a horrifying voice said, Foolish mortal, I am the almighty keyboard demon, and I have been summoned to steal all your keyboard keys. I was frightened and jumped back from my computer as the demon actually reached out of the screen, grabbed the keyboard, and removed just one key, the very top left-hand key. I was confused, and I summoned the courage to ask him, If you're such an almighty demon, why did you take only the top left key? And the demon replied, Because now, for you, there is no escape. <laughs> and we're out of here. It's all screwy. See you in St. Louis. There is no escape. Good thing the keyboard still has to delete. We can get rid of that joke. I mean, really. Good night, everybody. Well, we certainly hope <laughs> you don't want to escape from our program. Because we'll be back next time at the same place. We will <laughs> have plenty of demons and plenty of lemons. I'm trying to connect earlier jokes. They do that a lot on the Jack Benny show. Jack Benny, Google him. I'll Google you later. All right, see ya. Goodbye.